commercial areas, we'll have uh, significant overt and covert presence in our shopping areas and market districts. So those are some of the things you'll see. Also, you'll see more um, traffic management as the roads get more congested. And as I had said before, we'd prefer to manage the traffic than have to enforce, but we're quite willing to enforce if people are unwilling to just comply with the rules and regulations. And we'll be doing this through to the new year. Right, I see a question here. Any update on Jasmine Dean's uh, disappearance? Now, unfortunately, uh, no. Um, well, I'm not sure when last we updated on it, but to this point, we have not found her. We have used uh, significant police assets to try and locate her. We have persons in custody uh, for being associated with the crimes relating to Jasmine Dean. Particularly, we have found persons who had belongings of hers, etc. We do not have a, um, we have not found her, whether alive or dead, up to this point. And um, although those people have been charged and I think they've been convicted, of the, right, uh, so they're in custody, uh, it will take a year. Um, or just over a year for us to actually apply additional charges like the charge of murder to, to these, um, these persons. So that's where we are with that. As I say, uh, we will continue to reach out looking for other leads, looking for bits of information. It's not gone cold. Um, in other words, we have not left it as a cold case. We're still working on it. But as I say, we have two people in custody that we got into custody pretty quickly, just following up on uh, a number of leads and also using some electronics in that process and so on to find them. Uh, but to charge them further will take a little while from the event. Yes, yeah, CTOC, um, st that's still part of CTOC's mandate and is still doing it. Uh, sorry, uh, the question is, is CTOC still carrying out operations to find counterfeit goods? Uh, and the answer is, is yes, yes they are. Um, Christine Forbes, oh, again, <laughs> from CVM. Can you comment on recent reports of persons being robbed and beaten by persons posing as taxi operators, especially in the corporate area? Um, I can't give you an update on that right now. I don't know, right. Uh, but what we can do is look at that. We've seen the reports. Um, uh, we're really looking at how prevalent it is and so on. So we're doing some work on it, but let me not, I'm not gonna go further with it at this point, but we will update on it. Thank you very much, Commissioner. So, uh